Hey everyone, so I have a yard sale haul this week. Last week I was actually sick, so I didn't get to go yard sailing. Um, I just did not feel well at all. So my mom went yard sailing as usual, and she picked me up some things that she thought I'd like. So I'm going to start off with the stuff that she got me last week. Uh, the first thing that she got me was this Aeropostale bag, and she paid $2 for this. So it's just like a tote bag. Um, I like these actually to use when I yard sale. Um, if you're going to like a rummage sale or a community yard sale and you um, are picking up things and it makes it a lot easier to carry than like a whole bunch of plastic bags. So I do like these for when I yard sale. So she got me that. Um, she also got me these sandals and I don't know how much she paid for these. Okay, wait, no. The price is on the back. She paid $2 for these as well. And these are just black um, sandals with like a rhinestone um, strap. So these are actually a size 7, I believe. And I wear a 6, 6.5. They're a little bit big, but I can still fit them. So um, I'm going to hang on to them, at least maybe for this season. But... I haven't decided yet. She knows what size shoe I wear, but I guess she figured I could wear them. I don't know, but anyway. So she also got me this uh, Victoria's Secret candle, and it's in this red and black zebra print box. And this is um, the scent is called chocolate cocoa. It smells really good. She actually paid $10 for it. It retailed for $28. She paid $10. It's brand new. And it's just in a black uh, jar like this. And it's got three wicks. Oh, and it smells so good. Um, uh, it smells amazing. So she got me that. Um, let's see. She also got me a Victoria's Secret Pink all my heart fragrance mist and she paid five dollars for this it's brand new and this retailed for 15 so still a good deal smells really good and she got me a bunch of nail polishes she got me this sally hansen nail polish um sheer beige she paid 25 cents for all the nail polishes and they're all kind of like the same color this is a maybelline uh, nail polish in sheer ballet pink so she paid 25 cents for that as well and I have to do my nails so bad and I'm still kind of probably sound like I'm stuffed up so I'm sorry about that there's Sally Hansen in I do so these are all kind of like good for um, like a neutral nail and this one's an elegant nails pink cream and they all look brand new too so 25 cents <clears throat> and then the last one is a Sally Hansen in Nude Now. So that's what that one looks like. So she also got me this ring. This is like a big old rhinestone dome ring. It's huge. And it just looks like that. So that's cute. And she paid 25 cents for it. And the last thing that she got me was this soap, and it's by Wash Your Mouth Out Soap Company. This is actually um, a local company, and the soap is lavender vanilla. It smells really good. They actually sell this in a market um, in my old hometown, and I love going in there and smelling all of their soaps because they smell really good. So that was awesome that she found this. I don't know how much she paid, but they retail for $4.50 at the market. So I think she did pretty good with the stuff that she bought. I liked everything. And um, I mean, it sucks that I didn't get to go out myself in case, because she doesn't always, you know, pick up everything, you know, that I like. But I really do like what she picked out, and I think she did a great job. So I'm going to get on to the things that I got today, and I got a whole lot of stuff, and I think I did really good today. Um, before I start, I'm just going to start with this bracelet that I got, and hopefully you guys can see it. It's got a little owl in it, 
and I got this at a yard sale and then like one of the next yard sales that I went to this lady's like oh my gosh where did you get that bracelet it's adorable and I was like I got it at a yard sale 25 cents so I paid 25 cents for this bracelet really cute um I got this bamboo bath pillow it's brand new still in the casing I paid a dollar for this. I've been wanting a bath pillow for my bathtub. Um, just, you know, it's relaxing and everything like that. So I was pretty excited to find this. But I was just going to get like one of the, you know, random ones, like cheap ones. Like I think the bath, or yeah, I think that the Dollar Tree sells bath pillows. But this one actually looks really nice. Like it probably retailed for more than a dollar obviously but I got it for a buck. I ended up getting this mirror. I thought it was so cute. I paid three dollars for this and it's just a white oval mirror. It kind of got a distressed look to it with a little stand and then it has like a leaf um, design around the side and I paid three dollars for this. I ended up getting this coach purse and this bag as you can see it's got um some like faded marks on it like rubber marks i don't even really quite know what um, caused the bag to start looking this way but other than that it's in really good condition and it was only five dollars so i bought it and i don't think that it's going to be able to be cleaned or anything like that i don't think it's something like dirt I mean, possibly something was spilled on it, but I seriously think it just looks like it's faded and worn, maybe. I don't know, but it was $5, so I got it. Um, let's see. I got these slippers, and these are just the Muckluck slippers. So they got this cute little um, tree and snowflake design, and the insides are really soft. And these are brand new. I paid $2 for them. And they're actually not my size. They are a large size 8 through 9. And I wear a 6. So I probably would wear a small. But I haven't tried them on yet. If I can still wear them since they're just, you know, slippers. I might keep them. But I don't know yet. I have to try them on. But I thought they were really cute. And for $2, I had to buy them. Um, let's see what else. I got... I just picked up this um, backpack. I've been wanting a backpack that just slings over your shoulder. I don't have one. And this one's just purple with a pretty little design. Um, it's got some marks and stuff on it, but I only paid 50 cents for it. And I basically wanted this for um, when I'm on the motorcycle and if we're going somewhere and we might pick up a couple of things that way we can easily transport it back to our house so i got that for 50 cents and on the topic of motorcycles i got a jacket and this is just a black jacket it has a lining in it but uh i took it out just so you could see this jacket has like these um paddings in it like in the back and then there's some in the sleeves too so this is a motorcycle jacket for when you're riding and you know if something were to happen and I'd fall off it protects you so I found this this is by Joe Rocket Rocket Girl and I paid five dollars for this which is a really good deal because these jackets retail for like a hundred some dollars so and it's cute it's just black and you know, I mean, obviously I love pink, and I, I wish that it were pink, but uh, I can't always have everything that I want. So, it's still a really good deal, and for $5, you know, it's something you can't pass up. So, I got that. Um, let's see. I also, I got this bag, and this is a like a bag I have never seen before in my entire life and I hope you guys can kind of see it it's a black bag with like a mesh look and it's just in this odd crazy shape that I've never seen before and it's got this big tassel thing on the side on the zipper pull I should say and I paid two dollars for this purse and it's by a brand called 
Brio, which I had never heard before. I think it's um like a vintage kind of brand. Like they made these purses back in the day and they don't make them anymore. And some of them, I looked them up on eBay and they go for a good bit. Um, so I'm probably going to sell this unless I can find like a perfect outfit for it. I don't know. Um, but I paid $2 for it. <clears throat> and then I just threw some stuff in here that I got. Um, I also got this coach wallet for a dollar. And it looks like this. And it's dirty. I mean, it's made of this, like, suede. So I do have suede cleaner. So I'm going to try to clean it up a little bit just to see how, you know, if I can get it cleaned up. But for a dollar, I figured, you know, irregardless, it's still a really good deal. And the inside is in great condition. So that was a dollar. Okay, I also got these sandals. I think this is my first find of the day, actually. These are the first thing the first thing that I bought when I went yard selling. And I paid a dollar for these. And these are just by New York and Company. They're just black, um, strappy sandals. I thought they were really cute. And they go with, like, everything. So, I got those. I also got this bikini. And this is by Guess. And it's just, um, like a, kind of like a zebra brown zebra print I guess you'd say I don't even know and then it's got gold rhinestones around it and then the bottoms have um like a fringe I know this is horrible because it's all like put together but anyway I paid a dollar for it these are what the bottoms look like so I thought those were really cute so I got those um my mom actually picked me up this bag of Estee Lauder stuff. Um, I don't even think the lady realized that there was stuff in it, but it has like a bunch of little Estee Lauder things inside. It came, well, it came with like a pore minimizing cream or something, but my mom took that. But it also had a take it away makeup remover. It had a... Soft, clean, hydrating lotion. What's going on out there? What? Ambulance, yeah. police. Over where? Out front. The neighbor man. A soft, clean, tender cream cleanser. A time zone wrinkle reducing cream. Nope, he's okay. I don't know if it's him. Oh, he has that woman there, don't he? Um, an advanced night repair eye cream. And it also had an eyeshadow duo in Sandbar Beige, which is a matte eyeshadow, and a hot cinnamon, which is a shimmer, which just opens like that. So those are two pretty neutral colors. I got two shorts for my boyfriend, and they're just plaid shorts. This one's gray and blue and white plaid and this is by the brand Burt which I think they sell these at uh, Pacific somewhere and then this one is more like a dark grayish black and these are by Rip Curl. So I paid $2 a piece for them which is a pretty good deal so hopefully he likes them. I didn't get at a yard sale. I got this. Um, we went thrifting um, last week, and this is just a pink top. I'm throwing this in here. I'll probably put it at the end. Um, with cute little scrunchy sleeves. So it looks like that. I got a bunch of beauty related things. I got this Barbie. Um, train case and this is super cute it's just pink and it says Barbie all over it and has this like uh, little luggage tag kind of thing here so you can like take it um, on vacations and stuff and I paid 50 cents for this and the greatest thing about this is after I bought it uh, it was at a community yard sale so I had my dad carry it around the entire time until we got back to the car so that was fun <laughs> and the inside looks like this it has a mirror which this part needs to take it off. And then I have it filled with stuff. 
Um, I got this Bath & Body Works Fiji Passion Fruit Body Spray. This was a dollar. It's missing the cap, but oh well. I got this American Eagle Airy uh, Little Kisses to Go Lip Gloss Set in a tin. This was a dollar, and these are brand new. I got this Bath & Body Works Hello Sugar um, Shimmer Body Lotion. This was a dollar. I got a Victoria's Secret Sheer Love Body Lotion. This was a dollar. I got a Bath & Body Works Raspberry Vanilla Shimmer Mist. And this was two dollars. I got an Estee Lauder Perfume. And this scent is called Pleasures. And this was two dollars. I got this because my mom likes Estee Lauder stuff. And I thought maybe she'd like this perfume. Because I got a... Uh, well, I lagged behind, actually, and sometimes she doesn't notice things or pick them up. So I got them, got it for her, but she ended up not liking it anyway. I also got four Victoria's Secret Body Splashes. I got one in Raspberry Glace. I got one in Pear Glace. I got one in Peach Hyacinth. And then I also got one in Tranquil Breezes. And these were 25 cents a piece. I also got this little bottle of um, Airy, like from American Eagle, uh, body lotion in blushing. And this was only a dime. And then the rest of the stuff's jewelry. I got this bangle bracelet. And it's just white with like silver things. I don't know how to describe it. It's a bangle bracelet. It's pretty heavy. I also got this necklace, which I absolutely love. Um, it's, from what I can tell by this little thing right here, this tag, I'm pretty sure it's uh, Vera Wang, like the Simply Vera from Kohl's. So it's just on this black, uh, not even a chain it's just a suede black um what the hell would you even call that it's not a chain it's a necklace whatever anyway it's got um this long like i think they call it like a bib necklace and it's just got chains and rhinestones on it so that's really awesome i paid three dollars for this and the last thing that I found was this Coach keychain. And I don't know if this is authentic or not, so you guys have to help me out. Um, but it looks like this. It has little, like, tag things on it that say Coach. And I have a Coach keychain um, that I got at the Coach store, like, a really long time ago. And the main thing is that this doesn't feel really heavy like one that I have it's got some like weight to it and this feels really light so I'm kind of thinking that it's not authentic but I paid 25 cents for it so if it's not it's no big deal but I figured I'd buy it just because it was so cheap and it's cute too so um anyway that's all that I found I think that I did pretty good today and I hope you guys liked the video, and, um, I'd like you guys to leave a comment just to, um, say I'm curious, like, if you think, like, my mom did a good job yard sailing, like, without me, um, if you think she found good things. I made a Facebook page, I don't know if anyone's interested, but I figured I'd, I'd make one just so, you know, I have a way to stay in touch with you guys, like, I was sick, you know, and I don't know if anyone, you know, cares or wondered you know why I didn't make a video but if you do then you can follow me and you know I'll be able to like update you guys with things and also like you know I post stuff and everything like that pictures yada 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 um if you're interested and if you have a Facebook and we can be friends so anyway I hope you guys liked the video 